Chalice Interaction is the secret codes. The Rosetta Stone. Threshold. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. We at Winter is a place you could be here tonight. As you probably know, the Threshold Prize was begun on October 9th, 1958. The discovery of the natural anomaly known as the Threshold in the basement of the old Donner Building. Back then, we were dealing with some... Thing we knew nothing about. A strange and explicit force which seemed useless and untamable, but there were men with visions then, as there are now. We saw the potential of that little miracle in the basement. Those of you who have the privilege to follow the history of Wintech and Threshold know the disappointing results of our venture into the business with the United States military. The Threshold, it was decided, had little to no military applications. Although we at Wintech did not necessarily agree with that judgment, our funding was cut, and the Threshold remained silent for nearly 30 years. Now I am delighted to announce that we have discovered an exciting new possibility for the Threshold project possibility which could have been the positive effect not just on Wintech, but on the entire world. I'm sure you're all tired of listening to me talk. Without further delay, let me introduce the scientific director of The Threshold, Dr. Peter Sutcliffe. Very interesting. Alright. Let's log in as me. see here let's have a look at my emails read this Trevor Barnes Curtis I didn't manage to up your clearance so that you uh, I did manage to up your clearance so that you can get into the lower levels of the Wintech central computer security system the the, uh, the Wintech security system detected me and I had to get off there quick however I did get the secure com password so that you can raise your clearance yourself do it if you have to buddy Please be careful. Something tells me our cheerful employers are playing hardball. The password is Black Lotus. Don't ask me. That was Warner's idea, not mine. Take care, Trev. All right. You have a password. All right. Let's log out. Hold on. I need to uh, log out. Go back in. Paul Warner. Carpe Diem. We're in. Board of Directors, good news. Our external sources tell us that the Wintech is indeed the only company currently researching interdimensionality and its potential for earning profits. The Threshold Pride is still ramping up after almost 30 years of hiatus, but now that we expect to be fully online soon. Tests have proved that the Threshold equipment is still running properly, although some upgrades to the flex controls were necessary. No email. System login accounts. Name. Curtis Craig. All right. Black Lotus. Gotcha, you son of a bitch. Such language, Curtis. I should wash your mouth out with soap. Get away from me. Alright. I am now the highest level security clearance. All right. Um, this was just the, okay. Exit here. All right, let me save the game. Cookies. are getting creepy now. We're running 
out of time. Quickly! Time. It's going to close. Jonas, go get Merrick. Have him bring us another one. Quickly! Things are getting weird. God. Ten nine fifty eight. Oh, fuck, I, I fucked it up. Come along, Curtis. We've Damn got it. your room just as you left it. <laughs> Whoops. Yeah, now would be a good time to save. Bad things. Thank you, Pinata.
Password. Do y'all remember that one thing I got? The Rosetta Stone? Greetings, Plow Warner. I regret that we have been able to synthesize this chemical compound requested. Why? We've been able to complete synthesis because we lack the proper materials. Please provide us uh, alzapram, amitriptyline, chlorodiazepoxide, fluconazole, hydrocone, lithium, oxybutonin, simvolastin, trimfluperazine, ventoflamine, and two live adult human creatures. What's the status of the twin? D.A. Warner. You're communicating that the twin lives. Pierre Warner, we rejoice to hear it. Question. Define addiction. Why? You must understand the concept of addiction. We are to achieve the requested effect of the synthesis. P. A. Warner. Question. Define addiction. No. I don't understand your meaning. Please enter threshold transport and commence communication. Ow. Uh, this is apparently a game over, but I want to see it. Where's my... Oh, it's the same as before? Come along, Curtis. Yes, yeah, same one as before. Let's just get out of here. Let's get out of our work. Um, not too much fun things happening at work today. All right, let's go to the borderline. Hi there. You're looking sunny as ever. Hi. What are you doing all the way over there? Oh, that's your belly button. It's all right, I guess. Oh, yeah? Mm -hmm. Did you know that pulling on a navel ring is sexually stimulating? The sensation goes straight to your spinal cord. What are we gonna do tonight, Therese? We'll see. Come on, tell me what we're gonna do. No, I'm not gonna tell you, I'm gonna show you. Now drink up. I'm gonna need it. Oh boy, tell me you're drugged again. Uh, 
Follow me. Look, Therese just went in there. She told me to follow her. Seriously doubt it, my friend. Uh, did I miss any more sex? Did you see the one with his dad? You, I don't know if you were there for that one. Oh, yeah, I gotta do the... Um... Which one was it? Was it this one? It was this one. Well, no, but he was there. He did some sex and then his dad watched. All right, go ahead. Hope you survive the night, little man. Oh no, what's she gonna do to me? Oh boy. Are you guys ready for some puzzles? By puzzle, I mean just do that. Three. I hope the scan lines aren't too annoying for you guys, by the way. They don't show up on my end, but they show up in the stream. I could, I, hold on, could I do this? This might work. Hold on, what's the comparison? Oh, whoops, I clicked once. I wanna see the difference. Oh yeah, it looks a little bit better. Okay, we'll do this. Oh, you can still see the scan lines. It didn't help. I'll just go back to the previous mode. Oh, you can't see right now. Sorry. Uh, nothing much has happened. He's just checking out some rope. Oh, there's a hood. All right, can't get rid of the scan lines. That's fine. All right. Morning, everybody, again. We got some sex time. stream.
Hello? Come on. Who's there? This is a hardcore club. Jesus. Oh, blood electrocution? All right, well. Oh, good morning, detective. Where the hell were you last night? Where were you? I was with Therese at the borderline. And I came home. What, you want to ask my rat for an alibi? I know you were at the borderline, Craig. At least 20 people saw you there with Therese. Not an hour before she was murdered in the bathroom. <laughs> Look at this stance. Okay, I'm gonna save. Oh no. What the hell are you looking at? Oh, I think my rat got loose. You better find it before I do. How'd you do that? How did you get out? Yeah, this game, uh, it, it's not for the faint of heart, so if, if you're not liking it, then you should not watch it. What happened? Oh, I think you know. Damn it, I didn't kill her! I think you did, asshole. It's just a matter of time before you're arrested. I just hope to God it happens before you slaughter somebody else. Wow. I like Therese. I wouldn't have hurt her. Not ever. Is that right? You two had a strange way of showing your affection. Please, detective. I need to know what happened to Therese. A lot happened to Miss Banning, actually. I guess the short version would be that someone strung her up and fried her in her very own blood. Wow. I'll get him. Whoever he is, I swear to God, I'll get him. I'm sure the good people of the city will rest easier knowing that. She does not trust me. Why aren't you after Paul Warner? I mean, he's the one who's behind all this. I mean, he'd do anything to protect that, that, that threshold project, whatever the hell that is. Gosh, I better go arrest him right away. Oh, uh, and just for the record, who gave you this information? Space aliens? Get, out. Get the hell out! Fine, but I'll be back, you son of a bitch! I'll be back to nail your ass to the wall! It was actually space aliens. <laughs> you know, you never guess what I thought. This I is saw. the final uh, chapter, by the way, guys. Yeah, for a second there, I thought you were. But it's a long one. The Jurassic Rat. <laughs> <sighs> This is the final chapter, a long one, that. I love you, Blob. And no matter what, I'll make sure someone takes good care of you. Gonna be using the guide extensively for this act because I know nothing about this act. Uh, all right. Is the rat the killer? If only.
Will you play after this? I don't know. I don't know if I'll play anything after this or if I'll end the stream. We'll see. Maybe if other people are up for it, we could do the new Phasmophobia update. We'll see. But we still have a good while. This chapter's long. Alright. Let's go check our mail. Where's the mail? It's usually here by now. Oh, there it is. Just a WinTech logo. Ah. Okay. All right, well, let's, um, let's call our therapist. Dr. Ricky Harburg's office, how may I help you? Um, I, have, I have to see Dr. Harburg right away. I'm, um, I'm having uh, problems and I, uh... Um, yes, sir. I'll get her right away. Please hold. This is Dr. Harburg. Doc, this is Curtis. Um, um, I'm ha I'm having troubles. I need to see you. I... It's Therese. She, um... She's been murdered, and I... Oh, God, don't... Don't tell Dr. Merrick. He's, he's in on it. I mean, they're all in on it, and, and I... Oh, God, Doc, I have to see you. I have to see you now. It'll be all right, Curtis. Come on over, okay? Yeah, okay. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> Trisha, could you alert security? One of my patients is on his way over, and I believe he's in the middle of a psychotic episode. But please, don't have him intercepted. Just ask security to be ready if I call, all right? Will do, doctor. Oh, boy. You've been bugged. Oh, shit. Oh, Merrick. Oh, you spying son of a bitch! Curtis. You were right. He's mine! Dr. Harburg? I didn't like that channel. I didn't like calling that number. Oh, God! Beautiful work, Curtis. Just spectacular. The good doctor is truly your masterpiece. I didn't do it. I couldn't have. I wasn't even here. You didn't use your hands, Curtis. You don't have to. You used your mind. Your diseased, twisted, murderous mind. Get it. Get that thing. 
All right, let's get out. Let's go to work. All right. Well, let's just get some work done while we're here, shall we? Now they're at work. We might as well do some 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 work. These old fucking CRTs. What do you want from me? I only want you to be happy, Curtis. You've nearly lost your mind, haven't you? You'd be so much more at ease if you just give up the battle. You'll be well taken care of in the asylum. Get away from me! Recognize me, Curtis. I'm just a part of your own twisted mind. If you just give in to me, let me take over, you'll be so much happier. It won't hurt. What? No! <laughs> yes, hit him with a fucking coffee can. Hit him with a thermos. <laughs> thermos a bitch. No, I don't want that. Oh! Oh, my shirt's fine. According to the actor play Curtis Craig, that shirt itched like a motherfucker, and they had like 40 of them, and it's all he could wear for several months as they recorded this, and it was the worst. <laughs> Let's have some water. At least the water is fine. Okay, let's not have the water. Don't drink the water. Don't, 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 don't drink the water. Maybe we should drink the water. No. All right. Anything new in your, um... Uh... Anything new in your little stash here? No. Alright, well, let's log in. Uh... Yeah, I'm not really working on anything here right now. Uh, why? Grace, why- why did you kill me, you son of a whore? Trevor, forget Wintech. Forget Wintech and get out of here now. Marianne, fellow reunion. Oh, my mother! 
We'll be together again soon, my love, my monster, my baby son. Soon we'll be together forever, and then I can kill you, you murdering freak. I'll rip out your black twisted heart. Oh, and I've sent a message to myself. Dear Curtis, I really think we should check ourselves into the hospital right now. That nice Dr. Mac will take care of everything. We won't have to think. We won't have to feel. All we have to do is relax and ride the Thorazine. If we take it up, we won't even feel the scalpels or the shocks. He promised not to make it hurt that much. I trust him. Don't you? We're Curtis. Before we kill someone else. Your friend, Curtis. Oh, thank you, Curtis. How cool of you. All right. Let's log in again. As Paul Warner. Uh, fuck, what was his? It was uh, Carpe Diem. That was it. Gold mine. Gentlemen, I'm writing to you in an urgent attempt to gain more funding for the Threshold Project. We're on the verge of an incredibly important breakthrough. To succeed in utilizing the dimensional rip known as the Threshold to synthesize the chemical Lotus B, according to specifications, if it actually has the effect on the human body that we believe it will, it, it will WinTech will become a multi-billion dollar megacorp overnight. I understand that some of you have a reservation. The failure of the threshold to adapt to military applications along with the Jonas Craig debacle were most definitely setbacks to the project. However, once we discovered the threshold dweller's ability to synthesize chemicals, those setbacks became insignificant. The gold mine that shines before us is virtually bottomless. A partnership with the US government would have been nowhere near as lucrative. Imagine, if you will, an antidepressant as subtly and strongly addictive as nicotine. The only side effect is gradual loss of excess body fat. Everyone in the country, everyone in the world, in fact, will want it. Before long, everyone will need it as well. All yours to the taking, gentlemen, if you will just grant us the funds to finish our research. Sincerely, Paul Allen Warner. Alright. BD address. Good news. Our external sources tell us that Wintech is indeed the only company currently researching interdimensionality and its potential for earning profits. The threshold product is still ramping up after almost 30 years of hiatus, but we expect to be fully online soon. Tests have proven that threshold equipment is still running properly. I think we read this before. I think, yeah, I think we read this before. Oh, no, I didn't want to open that. Whoops. Yeah, let's go to the network room. Oh. Trev, you scared the crap out of me. I Curtis, mean, I listen, you... listen, listen. I've been delving deep into the company network. Just leave it alone, man. It's bad. I can't, Trev. I can't let it go. You, you, you don't get it, Curtis. I gave myself top clearance. I saw. They've been synthesizing illegal drugs. Curtis, they've killed before. Oh, my God. I'm, uh, I'm, uh, I'm going to the cops. No job is worth this. But, Curtis... I want you to stay out of it. I don't want you to get hurt. <sighs> Curtis, you know I love you. Strong cables. Oh. Oh, 
This is going to be difficult to not be blamed for. I don't think it matters anymore. You'll see in five minutes. Five to ten minutes. Oh, don't cry, kids. You see again. When his collar is starched. And wax in his nose and his jaws wired shut. There's a creepy fish man in the walls. Yeah. I'm the main one going to the unifier. his card from now on because he has the highest security clearance available Things are getting very intense. Did I put this in again? No. Again, again, Rosetta. Greetings, Paul Warner. When are we received the live raw materials? Our artists, our holy ones, our scientists await. We are pleased that more materials be provided. Live materials do not last long. Human creatures do not withstand recombination or absorption. Why? Cohesive organisms such as human creatures are not designed for recombination and absorption. We should think you would know that by now, P.A. Warner. When? Do not understand your meaning. Please enter threshold transport and commence communication. Well, we're allowed in.
bat button, right? Yes. From Dimension X, of course. Ah, Dimension X. You killed my father, didn't you? He became a liability. Not everyone is strong enough to handle the sacrifice of human subjects for research. Son of a bitch. You know, it's a good thing your dear old dad never knew he didn't really get his little boy back. He'd have lost his nerve much sooner. talking about don't you remember I threw poor little Curtis in there but he never came out you did you're a replica you're some kind of imitation human those things on the other side put together out of slime and dead rats and a little bit of Curtis's brain tissue oh I told your father it was you that there'd been a terrible accident. And he believed me because he wanted to. No. Yes, I'm afraid so. You started remembering a year ago. So the rat is the killer. To observe <laughs> Not really, but. I should say to observe you more closely. I'm made of rat meat. You see, we've been watching you like a bug in a jar ever since those things spit you out of the threshold. Where am I? Where is he? Who will allow me to introduce myself? Curtis Craig, at your service. Oh, it's Curtis. Hello, Curtis. Oh my god. No, I can't be. You are a slow, glad, and trolling tattle. What you see now is an electrical projection. A manifestation of my hatred for you. My body, my human body is in there. It is a twisted, wretched mess, kept alive by the cannibalized body parts of corpses. Those amorphous things just go about their lives all around me, combining, recombining, playing with the monstrous things that warn against them. They never even touch me. Oh God, I'm so sorry. Are you, are you sorry that my body is a sickening apparition? Are you sorry that I haven't slept for 20 years? I've been awake, Curtis, watching you. Building my towers so that I can smash you, destroy you, take your life the way you took mine. It wasn't my fault. I didn't do it to you. I, I'm a victim too. Poor baby. The pain will stop very soon. Once your mind breaks, your body will be mine. I almost got you, you know. When you're in the asylum. Almost. No. No, don't. It's time to go now, Curtis. Say goodbye to your sanity. Oh god. Okay, I wanna save. Uh yeah, test. I wanna see the death.
Okay, he just electrocutes me. Forget about Freeman. Welcome to fucking Planet X. Or Dimension X. I'll take some goo. You never know, you might need some goo. Take one of those. Pick one of those. Okay. Now we have some weird creatures. with a tail. Uh, starfish. Oh, I think I did it wrong. I think I did it wrong. Unless... Oh no, I have that. Um, take some of the fungus. They were eating. Oh, is this the fungus they were eating? That was the fungus they were eating. Uh, combine the horseshoe and the starfish alien. Look at that computer animation. You don't want to see the ending? Alright, we've made a new alien. Uh, take some of the fungus that they're eating, combine them, go through the hole in the wall. Okay. Uh, put this down. A hole? Okay. Got it. Okay. Getting weird, boys. We're gonna save.
let's save. Alright, we're gonna call this, uh, Zen. Look who we found. Curtis, even though you've been cheating on me with Therese, I love you. Just... <sighs> but what if things were different? What if everyone had a gun? I love you too much to ever let you go. All right, let me just <laughs> take your gun. Zombies. Okay, I have to see the death. I have to see it. I'm not gonna click anything. I have to see what happens. Come on. Tom. Tom, I swear to God, it wasn't my fault. Oh God! It wasn't my fault. Oh, here we go. Phantasmagoria 1 had a woman's head being decapitated. That's lame. Oh! You know, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Again. Oh my god, I'm really being hexed. 
Pull a lever. Oh, hey, Reptile. We're at near the end of the game. Uh, we're in an alien world, and the alien is trying to kill us through our mind. Come here, Curtis, sweetheart. I have something for you. Slime? Killing Glop. Here we are. Um. Yeah, that was me, actually. That was the real me. Uh, I am a clone. this on something. I'm not sure what. Maybe here? Ah! Oh boy. Okay. You can fuck this up so badly. Save. Oh no. Okay. Use the colored keys of the left and bottom of the screen as a guide to attaching the colored wires. Okay. Click once on the knob with a small red arrow. Okay. Click on the round lens with an opening in it until the opening is approximately 10 o'clock. Round lens with an opening in it. This one. That's roughly it. Uh, 
click on the spigot right above the round lens. This will change the red circuit at the left of the screen. Click the round lens until it opens approximately the 2 o'clock position. I guess that. Uh, look at the spigot above the round lens to charge the ray. Look on the knob with a small red arrow. This one? <laughs> Click on the triangle until the red dot is in the lower right. Isn't there already? It already is. Oh, the yellow dot, sorry. Wait, no. Click the ray to shoot the light. Click the ray to shoot the light. Uh, or, uh, click the triangle to the yellow dot is a little alright. yellow and blue toggles in that order. Red, yellow, blue. Okay. Repeat steps 8 through 14. Complete. Go back to the threshold. Uh, it doesn't look complete to me. Okay, let me redo it. Wait. Oh, I have to do these? I didn't do these. Okay. There's my issue. Yes, like so? No. Not undo. Now it might work. Let's do it again. Click on that. Uh, run lens until it's probably 10 o'clock. Click that. 2 o'clock. Red. 
yellow, blue. Red. Yellow. Blue. Red, yellow, blue. So confusing. Oh, red, yellow, blue. Is it done? It didn't work. This is confusing. Okay. Okay, no, let me reset it. Red attached to blue. Purple attached to green. Red attached to blue. This isn't really the right color. Unless, no, these are wrong. Uh, let go. I guess this would be their... They have the weird color here. This doesn't look red to me. Let's try that. Does this still look right to me still? I guess. Do that. This is really weird. puzzle. I hate things like this. Okay. Red, yellow, blue. Eight to fourteen again. I know what 
who you are. I love you. Please. Let's start with um, becoming an alien, guys. We'll talk about it, Josh. Oh. You're still alive? I'll do what's right. I promise. Weak ending. <laughs> Except for that. Oh, the game just closes. Alright, let me boot it back up so you can show you the other ending. The game just shuts off. Wow. Alright, let me boot it back up so we can see the other ending. Just here. Big time exec like Paul Warner killed all those people? Yeah, sure I do. Suits are evil, you know? Where do you suppose he is now? Mm. Panama, munching liver and fava beans. <sighs> liver and You're fava beans. I love the bikini I got. It is so tiny. I swear, it's this big. <laughs> oh, and I picked up some really strong sunblock because I know how you burn. Oh, it's gonna be wonderful. Blue Mediterranean seas, sunwashed beaches. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're not gonna regret this, Curtis. I promise. Oh, God. Wow. Thank you, Lorelai Shannon, for the writing. That was both endings to Phantasmagoria 2. These credits are almost unreadable, they're so low quality. This is a great song. I love it. Why are the credits the best part of these two games? They are so 90s. But yeah, uh, that was Phantasmagoria 2. I knew a lot more about this game. I'd seen the uh, ending before on a YouTube video called... Ah, uh, oh, fuck, what was it? It's uh, Ross's, uh, Ross's Game Dungeon, Phantasmagoria 2. I saw the ending roughly two years ago. Uh, and I knew a lot about the game. Uh, so I figured using a guide to get through the game pretty quickly wouldn't hurt. And yeah, it was a fun game. Um, I think the first game has a better build-up. It takes much longer for the first game to really...
get crazy. The game's just gonna close again, isn't it? The game just closed, yeah. Yeah, um, the game's... Let me, let me see if I can get that song up. What would it be called? Phantasmagoria to credits theme. I want it playing in the background. Is it? Yeah, there it is. You get it in a good volume. I need to put that in my music playlist now. Yeah, um... The first game has a lot better build-up. However, two gets there instantly. Immediate murders. Immediate horror. I think two is a better horror game. And it's pretty creepy. Uh, it feels more realistic as well because you're in an office environment. Whereas the first game you're in like a fucking beautiful castle. But still, I really liked this game. It was good. And yeah, I'm sad that there aren't more of these. Uh, the original writer for the first game said uh, she'd make another if these games ever become popular again. I don't think that's happening, but I wish it would. I will say I was more disturbed by this. Yeah, there's less... There's less horrible deaths to the main character in this, but there's more horrible deaths to everyone else. Um, when it comes to adventure game bullshit, this one has a lot of it. There's a lot of like tiny things you have to do or you can't continue. It's one of those games where you kind of need a guide. This song is a fucking bop. This song is really good. Anyways, um, I don't know if you guys are up for it, but would you be willing to